This is the council chamber, and Caden's huh. all like, "Huh? What's up, Caden?" You sure have to climb a lot of stairs to reach the council. I think that's supposed to be symbolic of their importance. That's a really some really deep thinking, Caden. I'm impressed. The one over by the keeper. Hey. What? Oh no, I wasn't. Never mind. <laughs> I'm not letting this go. Carry on. Nothing to see here. Uh, what are you doing? Why are you so interested in the keepers? Keepers? I've got no interest in the keep. Don't get coy. I know what I saw. I, uh, yeah. I'm not so sure I should be talking to you about this. Why not? We're just talking. Is there something wrong with that? No. I guess it wouldn't hurt to tell you. I'm using a small scanner to gather readings on the keepers. So far, I've had mixed results. I find it difficult to get near the creatures. Okay. Why were you being so secretive about it, though? Well, technically, we're not supposed to disturb the keepers. I don't really think my scanning disturbs them, but the authorities might disagree. I'd like to do it more openly, but it's not really worth getting arrested over. Hmm. Hmm, let me help. I can help you out. I'm not worried about the authorities. I don't even know who you are. I'm with the Alliance. We don't respect authority. I'm Commander Shepard of the Alliance military. Hmm. Well, I, I suppose I could use the help. You'll need this. It's the scanning device I developed. Activate it each time you see a keeper. All collected data will automatically upload to my database. I'll even send a few credits your way for each unique scan. Got it. I should get going then. Yes, I have much work myself. So long, and good luck with the scanning. That's definitely something I'm going to do off camera. There are 15 of these bastards, and they're everywhere. Hmm. So I'm going to probably pull out the old game facts <laughs> and go to town on that. Um, all right, so we have two options. First one is to go to Cora's Den and track down that drunk guy. Second one is to go talk to Bar Levon, and I trust Anderson's recommendation to just go talk to our friend Bar Levon. So let's go Presidium locations, and actually, I think it might be faster to go straight down through the elevator. Let's go that way. I'll probably actually cut ahead to uh, to where Barlevon is in post editing, so we don't have to do this long trip. How long do you think so we've the been? Citadel's really spacious in this game. Yeah, it's it's really crazy spacious it's the biggest um that it is in any of the games oh wait a minute wait a minute we haven't experienced this yet oh yes <laughs> the infamous elevators ashley's so sad i hate politicians i hate politics my whole squad's dead come on ashley is there anything positive you have to say about anything? I can't wait to kill more Geth. Thanks, Ashley. Look at that bug thing over there. What's it doing? We've already We've established. About the key. <laughs> Is that one of the ones you're supposed to scan? I'll. I'm. I'm not gonna bother with it right now, but I'll come back to it. Like, I want to make sure I get all of them, so I'm just gonna do a all in one run. That's a monument of the Halo Three logo. I believe so. I don't know. Every time I look at the, um, it's a monument. Every time I see the mass relays, I think of a Halo logo. Yeah, it's really similar. Similar. I was gonna say it's a monument to the Citadel's dick. The Citadel is a dick. It is. All right. Shwoogity boogity. Hi, Barlavon. What's this? One of the Earth Clan. Ah, a very famous one. Yes. You are the one called Shepard. You were at Torfin, correct? You led the final assault against the enemy base, if memory serves. He's pretty knowledgeable. Uh, have we met? You've got me at a disadvantage here. Forgive me, Earth Clan. 
My name is Barla Vaughn. My job makes it necessary for me to keep informed. I am a financial advisor to many important clients here on the Citadel. When someone as important as yourself arrives on the station, I take notice. I was told to talk to you. I heard you work for the Shadow Broker. Do you have any information about Saren? You're very blunt, Shepard. But you're right. I am an agent for the Shadow Broker. And I do know something about Saren. Uh, what's it gonna run me? I hear your information can be expensive. Normally, this information would cost a small fortune. But these are exceptional circumstances. So I am going to give it to you for free. What a bro. Hm. What's the catch? There is no catch. The Shadow Broker is quite upset with Saren right now. They used to do a lot of business until Saren turned on him. What a shock. Saren betrayed him. Imagine that. No matter what you think of Saren, he's not stupid. He knows the Shadow Broker is a valuable ally. Turning on him doesn't make sense. Not unless something huge was at stake. I don't know the details, but the Shadow Broker hired a freelancer to deal with it. A Krogan mercenary. Where are you at? How do I find him? I heard he was paying Citadel Security a visit. If you hurry, you can probably catch him before he leaves the C-Sec Academy. Let's go. Thanks for the info. My pleasure, Commander. <laughs> I'm happy. You're about to see why I'm happy. Okay. <laughs> okay. Well, so. Because when you, usually when you just start cackling for no apparent reason, it kind of makes me want to run in the other direction. All right. I want to make sure. Can I go straight to CSEC? Damn it, no. Okay. In order to get CSEC, we gotta go back to the embassies. It's kind of nearby that. All right. Ah! Ah! Whoa! I'm out. <laughs> With the recent attack on Eden Prime, many colonial investors are pulling their support for future projects. Proponents of expanded human colonization insist that Eden Prime was an isolated case. Nevertheless, colonist enrollment has dropped sharply. Many colonial proposals are on hold until backers have some reassurance that human colonies will be adequately protected. This has been Mad Money. I've never watched that I like show. This, uh, I like this music. I actually can't hear it. Oh. So. It's very soft. Yeah. But it is a bit more up-tempo than the last one. Do you see who I see? It's oh, Rex! Hey. Witnesses saw you making threats in Fist's bar. Stay away from him. I don't take orders from you. This is your only warning, Rex. You should warn Fist. I will kill him. You want me to arrest you? I want you to try. Go on. Get out of here. Yes, human. Uh, you can help me. I'm trying to bring down Saren. Barla Vaughn said to talk to you. Barla Vaughn is a wise man. We may share a common goal, human. How so? Enlighten me. I've been hired to kill the owner of Korra's Den, a man named Fist. He did something very foolish. Let me guess. He betrayed the Shadow Broker. A Quarian showed up here on the Citadel. She was on the run. She wanted to trade information for a safe place to hide, so she went to Fist. He promised to arrange a meeting between her and the Shadow Broker. Instead, he contacted Saren. That was a big mistake. Why? Fist's not too smart. He's just greedy. Saren paid him a small fortune for the Quarian. He had to. Oh. She has evidence connecting him to the Geth. Oh. If we get our hands on that evidence, we can prove that Saren's a traitor. And the council will have to listen to us. We gotta find her. Where's the Quarian now? Last I heard, Fist still had her. Probably somewhere inside his club. You help me kill Fist, she's all yours. Um, what about Shabroger? I want to know more about your employer. Can't tell you much. 
All I got was a coded message with the details of the job. Standard procedure. What about Garrus, that Turian? He wants to take Saren down too. We can use him. He might we don't need him. him. He was here just before you showed up. Said he was going to follow up a lead on his investigation. Wanted to speak to the doctor at the med clinic. Move out. Sweet. All right, we got party selection, and we're obviously taking Rex. And we're also going to take Caden. So now we have a completely lopsided spectrum. Hi, buddy. He's so happy.